Do you have a turntable and you're interested in connecting it to a pair of powered speakers, but you're not sure how to make that connection because the powered speakers do not have a phono input? Well, there's two easy ways to make this connection that I'm gonna show you in this video. Let's start with the first connection now. Now, a lot of modern day turntables have a built-in phono preamp, which you will need to use to connect to the powered speaker over here on the right. Now, what you're looking for on your speaker is a phono input or a line input switch. This is often on the rear of the unit. It can sometimes be located um, underneath the platter. You're going to find that switch and you're going to switch it from phono to line input. You are now using the internal phono preamp of the turntable. You're going to take your RCA cables and connect those to the RCA input on your powered speaker. Because you're now using the internal phono preamp here on the turntable, your powered speakers will be able to play your records properly. Now let's say you have a vintage turntable that does not have an internal phono preamp. In that case, you will need to buy an external phono preamp like this Project Phono box, and you will need to insert that between the turntable and the powered speaker. And this will boost the audio signal to the RCA input here on the powered speaker. Now, these can be found on Amazon for very cheap or very expensive, and I will include links to some of my favorites in the comments below in case you would like to purchase one of those. Let me pull all this together and show you how to connect this phono preamp to your turntable and powered speaker. Now looking at the rear of the external phono preamp, you can see I've now inserted this in between the turntable and the powered speakers. And I've done that by taking the RCA cables from the rear of the turntable and connecting those to the input on the external phono preamp. Now, if your turntable has a ground wire, make sure to make that connection there and that will eliminate any humming noise. Then you're gonna take another pair of RCA cables and connect it to the output of the external phono preamp. You're gonna take those cables and connect those to your powered speaker. Now your turntable signal is being sent through the external phono preamp, which will now boost the signal to be loud enough to be played by your powered speakers. Well, that's how you make a connection for a turntable to powered speakers. Now, in this video, the powered speakers I'm using are a pair that were recently sent to me that I reviewed and really enjoyed using with my turntable in my office. If you'd like to learn more about the Vigilant Audio Switch 1 speakers, you can do so by watching this video here.